What's going on guys, it's Shane. We are back here again with another video. Today we're going to be returning to Carson, Michigan, owned by American Bus Company. Uh, today we're just going to be doing a field trip route. Uh, we're going to go be picking up the high school students and taking them to the, um, I believe, the uh, that um, aviation center over there. I don't know officially what it's actually called, but... Um, I do know it's over there. You can see the control tower from here. So, uh, we're in an HDX today, 2022. The window down because the, well, I was going to say it's um, nice outside, but... Uh, doesn't appear to be that way. At least it's not raining, though. I believe that's the high school over there. We are just waiting. There's a camera right there. That's an awkward spot to put a camera. Well, they got one there, one up there, and then one... Oh my goodness, they have so many. Total of four cameras on the inside. And then about four on the outside, I believe, as well. No. Only two on the outside? Oh god. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Only two on the outside, I think, on this side. I don't see... I don't know why there aren't any others on this. Well, I guess it's just to view the stop signs, I guess. I don't really know. You know, it's weird. In real life, when I used to ride the bus, it seemed like every bus driver hated their job. <laughs> it's like they got into it for the sake of just making money. I never know how to pull in here. Um, take this outer road here. But we'll only just be recording the drop-off. Uh, and then we'll end it there. And we're not going to be recording the... Um, kind of you know pick them back up and take them back to school because uh, this is kind of an all-day thing here um, yeah they'll be at that uh, location for a while uh, did I go oh no I think we do this I think we're working right here I guess I have no idea this this parking lot so complicated which is makes sense to me because I don't play the game, so I wouldn't know. Uh, obviously, handicap buses go in there, which would make sense because it's kind of a a shorter walk from the school. Um, you know what I noticed though? There's no doors in the back of the school, so do they have to like walk out the front? And it's kind of a school where it's like one of those older ones that's more like preppy. It's not... When I look at this school, I don't think of a public school. I don't know. That's just me. I wonder if uh, ABC's working on their own passenger system. Because I know there's a few groups out there that have their own... Um, actually... Uh, so I'm thinking of Midwest Bus Company, JustGames.cc, uh, Infinity Bus of or Infinity, Infinity something. I forget the rest of their name. Uh, they all have uh, their own custom little passenger systems. Uh, and then I think I think those are the only 
bus simulators on Roblox that have one. I'm trying to think if anyone else does. I'm probably forgetting one, aren't I? I don't know. As far as like known school bus simulators go, uh, what's the best route? Definitely not this way. We're going to make a right. I don't think we can go right on red. So we're not going to. Well, it's actually a blinking yellow. Yeah, I didn't see that there. I don't know if that applies to us or not. Probably doesn't. I have no idea. I don't know the laws in Michigan. Man, I remember taking the field trips back in the day. I make it sound like it was so long ago, but it wasn't. Um, the bus ride, you know, you know what was crazy? It was almost as if the bus rides were the fun and the field trip was kind of just, you know, there. Because uh, everybody knew the, the bus ride on the way to the field trip was always the funnest because we would get so hype. You'd be sitting with people you normally don't sit with on a bus, you know. It was just very fun. Very, very fun. I think the last field trip I ever had in school was to, it was my senior year, obviously, and it was, believe it or not, it was actually to a, uh, a trampoline park. So, it was weird. It was fun, though. Everybody got on the bus and they were all sweaty. It was not a fun ride home. I was hoping I could drive the EFX in this game, but I don't see it anymore. It's probably in one of the game passes now. Which I don't believe I'm going to buy. I would buy a game pass for this game, but like I said, it, the, at the prices they are, and, you know, I don't play this game that often. You know, I'm not stupid, you know, I value, uh, uh, yes, I have a lot of Robux, but I, I, I think back to a time where I didn't, so I obviously want to hold on to them, uh, and, I mean, you know, I'm not going to stupidly spend them, you know what I mean? Why would I spend them on a game I don't play? And that applies for everyone, even at NBC, people go ahead and they buy these, uh, I guess we could take that way. I'm not 100% sure we're going to, though. People buy these buses. I mean, you know, the premium buses, right? And the Game Pass buses. They're obviously high-priced. Before you buy one, actually think about, am I going to be playing this game two months from now? If I'm not, then don't buy it. You know what I mean? And that's that's why they complain about the premium buses and how they're taken from them. That's why I say they're they're mainly for active users. If you're not gonna be an active user, don't buy one. Oh god, we're driving off the road here. Oh, there's a train here. Okay, we need to get a screenshot. Oh boy. I don't know how long this is gonna take. And they don't have like an animated train, do they? I don't think they do. There we go. Nice. OK, 
Okay, hopefully we can get there from here. I think we can. Yeah, so we're just going to be recording the uh, kind of the trip here. We won't be recording the trip back. So it'll be a short video, but it's okay. It's okay. I do this for my share, f my fair share of. Oop, I can write my fair share of um, ABC players out there. I make sure to play those games that you want to see or love to see. Somebody's been telling me to play some mobile um, bus simulators. I wouldn't even know where to start. I don't know any bus simulators that are mobile optimized except for, uh, sorry, just games. And uh, actually, that's the only one I know of. I don't know any other ones. Carson Aviation Museum. That's what it is. Gotta get a screenshot here. Bang. Okay. Okay. Um, I guess we'll just kind of follow the arrows here. And we'll drop them off right over there. Try not to hit the curb here. There we go. We'll drop them off right here. Why not? Okay, enjoy your time. I would take a screenshot right here, but it's so plain. I guess because... I don't know. Do I have... No, I don't know if they have free cam. Uh... No. If, well, I don't know. They need to add that. Alright, everybody almost off? Good, because I'm not coming back to get y'all. Just kidding. Okay. Well, let me go ahead and shut this off. Oh, I meant to take that empty sign off. Oops. People hate it when I leave that on there. My bad. Uh. There we go. Now, I forget how to turn that off, but, uh. Let me just despawn that. Anyway. Uh, if you guys like the video, please leave a like and subscribe. If you do wish to play the game yourself, it will be linked in the description down below. With that being said, if you guys like, I already said that. I already said that. See you guys next time.